an updated Volkswagen Tiguan, is coming our way for the 2022 model year. While the compact crossover maintains much of the current Tiguan's mechanical bits, it benefits fresher looks courtesy of reworked front and rear styling. Still, the boxy VW might make a more memorable impression if it offered coupe body style. Meet the Tiguan X, the swoopier sibling to the standard Tiguan. Volkswagen took the wraps off the model at the Beijing Motor Show in China. Made in and for the Chinese market, the Tiguan X is a surprisingly attractive addition to the Tiguan line, but its tumbling roofline surely cuts into cargo space and likely eliminates any possibility of a third row of seats. As you would expect, if you look strictly at the front of the vehicle, you won't notice any differences compared to a standard facelifted Tiguan. Obviously, it's a wholly different story from the C-pillar towards the back where there's a gently sloping roofline, plus a massive hatch. It's important to note that, the Tiguan X is significantly longer at 187,79 inches, making it even longer than the Tiguan LWB. In fact, the model is actually based on the Tiguan Allspace, which easily explains its dimensions. Revised from the B-pillars rearward, the Tiguan with the X features a sloping roof and a raked rear window, complemented by a lip spoiler on the liftgate. Chromed roof rails and exhaust finishes are included in the R-line specification, which also includes a badge in the front grille and the larger wheels with a dual-spoke design. Arrow-shaped elements for the taillights, a fake rear diffuser, and door handles that complement the shoulder line are meant to make the Tiguan X a sporty vehicle, though that's certainly not the case. A full-on A doesn't have chances of happening, but a plug-in hybrid may be launched sometime in 2021. Under the hood, you'll find two four-cylinder TSI options with 186 horsepower and 220 horsepower. They are offered as standard, with a 7-speed dual-clutch DSG automatic gearbox with no three-pedal configuration planned. The dual-clutch transmission sends the suck squeeze bank low to all four corners with the help of full motion, and at launch, a lesser engine option with 186 PS or 183 horsepower will also be available. Thanks for watching, and give your comments below.